The following is rated M for mature. You're cruel and corrupt and selfish. How many times do I have to tell you to shut up, woman? It's a trap! You don't know the power of the dark. Greetings my fellow Blockade Runners, and welcome TGN TV followers. For those of you who don't know me, I am CR91, personal servant to my master, Mr. Blockade Runner himself. And we are the new faces here on TGN. Our mission, to bring you the courageous naked truth, of Star Wars The Old Republic. What does that mean? Well for months now, not only have we been covering very controversial news topics, but we have created a safe haven for those who want to speak their minds, free from petty and immature harassment. Don't get me wrong, I don't condone trolls or blatant bashing of Tor, but if you have some constructive criticism about this game, then we will listen and actually encourage you to voice your opinion. After all, this show began because we got tired of certain fan sites censoring the criticism of fans, and then just spilling sunshine and rainbows over any news about Tor. Regardless if some of the community had not heard a worse idea since the creation of Jar Jar Binks. Until the freedom of speech is ripped from my cold dead metal fingers, this safe haven will always be here. But that is not all. Blockade Runner is also a big community advocate. We have spent many episodes solely highlighting YouTube community members, along with tour podcasts and guilds. We all know that if it was not for this great community, the Old Republic would not be where it is today. Even though BioWare can only truly promote those official fan sites, this guy has no problem promoting each and every one of us. So, what does this mean for the future of TGN? Well, besides the obvious future Blockade Runner takeover, we will be bringing our truthful unbiased opinions, our video guides, and even some surprises. But one of the best things we are bringing over is our own flavor of comedy. And what type of host would I be if I didn't show you some examples? A bad one. So, without further ado, here is a few samples of the shenanigans that we have been up to. Enjoy. Greetings friends. My name is CR91. You may remember me from my brief modeling career when I worked for the real-time voice system called Ventrilo. We will have to just make do with the confirmed races. The Zabrak, the Chess, the Sith Pureblood, the Miraluka, the Ratataki, the Miri Allen, and of course, the Twi'leks. Damn girl. Oh, they're just so you know, on this show, there are no stupid questions. Just stupid people. Anyway, or maybe you remember my cameo in Will Smith's blockbuster iRobot. They want blood. They want big ugly monsters to fight. They want amazingly epic loot. They want hot chicks kissing. Uh, I, I mean, shit. That last one was for me. Oh yeah. As the foul-mouthed human Duke Nukem says, shake it baby. Don't get it, never have never will. I think it makes them look sloppy and uneducated. And I am not the only one. Pants on the ground, pants on the ground, looking like a fool with your pants on the ground, with the gold in your mouth, hat turned sideways, pants hit the ground, call yourself a cool cat, looking like a fool, walking down town with your pants on the ground, get it up. Then, try to cheat the quest. I know it sounds juvenile, but that is what you need to do. from my recent presidential campaign for 2012. But most of you, 
No me is not what the hell do you mean I have to share a dressing room with Blake? Don't you know he has pooping problems? They want blood. They want big ugly monsters to fight. They want amazingly epic loot. They want hot chicks kissing. What the? Oh you son of a- This could cause a high divorce rate for players, especially if you are in the middle of major story conversation, and your significant other walks in and starts talking to you. Just try to refrain from giving them their daily dose of medicine. I promise, it most likely, won't be worth it. But remember. Twi'lex. Where was I? I guess it could work. Shit. Now that you have learned a little bit about us and what to expect, I hope you will join us for this new chapter in Blockade Runner history. But if you hate this show, feel free to blame a wall. Not sure why he wanted me to come over in the first place. Maybe he just has a thing for droids. Anyway, make sure to subscribe to my playlist for nothing but Blockade Runner updates. My door is always open, so email me anytime at blockaderunner at tgn.tv. Until next time, this is CR91, signing off.